So I'm Nancy Sullivan. I've been a senior investigator at the NIH um, since the Vaccine Research Center opened in 2000. Um, I lead uh, the, vac the Viral Pathogenesis Laboratory, and I'm chief of the Biodefense Research Section. Um, in that capacity, um, I've actually really had the good fortune of collaborating with my INRB colleagues for almost that whole time that I've been at NIH. Um, the original goal uh, was to capacity build and provide training opportunities. I have to say, in all honesty, uh, they've taught me more probably than, than I've taught them. Um, and it, those lessons really informed a, a paper that Barney Graham and I wrote in Nature Immunology back in 2018, before the, the COVID pandemic where we were very focused on preparedness um, in contrast to response. Um, that paper focused on two things. One was the UN had just established um, the idea of sustainable development goals. And there were about 20 initiatives, starting with uh, no hunger, no poverty, access to clean water, and so forth. And so what we did was we tied those into preparedness uh, rather than response for pathogens. And if you think about it, if you can eliminate hunger, then you're eliminating a transmission chain when people are uh, needing to hunt uh, monkeys, for example, as a food source. Uh, so they're, they're all tied together. Also, access to clean water. You know, there are a lot of the waterborne pathogens. And so if we can um, tie in sustainable development and really go to the places where these diseases are endemic and where people know the most about those, they should be doing the diagnostics. We should be funding countries where they're endemic to do the diagnostics, to define the transmission chains, and to do all of those things that are going to help us stop these diseases before they cross over into humans and cause pandemics. And there are, there are no better people that I can think of to do that, at least from my personal experience, <clears throat> than this really strong group at INRB. And that's been Mayembe's focus over all these years, to improve public health, um, to go out at the community level, help educate, um, train, to be able to prepare better when these things occur. Um, on the response side, it also is sort of preparedness, and this is where I've been fortunate to be at NIH, where my work was funded generously to um, study mechanisms of immunity against viruses with a, with a focus on filoviruses initially, and it was those studies that led to the development of a vaccine, um, and now many vaccines, and then the work with Professor Mayembe and his team for the development of a monoclonal antibody. And so I, I think if we could expand that funding to cover more of the lower and middle, middle income countries, I think we all will benefit by being prepared and having to respond less.